Hi guys, subscribe to my channel, leave a comment, leave a like, share this video among your fathers, okay? <clears throat> and yeah, so now I have an idea. Uh, I have an idea to have a hosting, you know, some hosting. and deploy application for free explorer services. Okay, let's go. Oh no, I'll spawn out. Mm. Why everything is, is freezing on this website, Oracle, come on. Come on, guys. What are you doing there? Oh my goodness. <laughs> what is going on, guys? I'm a human man. Please click each image containing a plant. Is free access to essential. Um, but my my yeah, actually no no a lot no. Okay yeah let's continue but actually no, I have another idea let's um, let's meanwhile run arch. Sorry, what Oracle? Weak? Are you serious? You are weak, not me. Okay. Oh my. Hey, what about Ukraine, okay? Where is it continue? Ukraine. What? Kiev? What? <laughs> okay. I'll say Germany. Okay, meanwhile, Arch is already downloaded, so we can connect to it. Uh, SSH. What is this? Yeah, I think we can do it on this one. Superb. So now my idea is to run. It looks like it's somewhere in SSH. Okay, don't 
aber ja. Minus one. Okay, so maybe I should start this. It will take long, you know. Oh, man. <sighs> yeah, by the way, I forgot to read some comments. Стрелочку по запустить VirtualBox, если ты настроил SSR сервер, то можешь нажимать запустить форму в режиме, чтобы он сел в панели. Окей, окей. На русском же лучше. Зачем на английскую аудиторию заходить? Um, I, I mean, everybody can understand English, okay? It's easier. You start hate Ubuntu, why? I don't hate it. Ah, um, yeah. Yeah, so there was like several reasons, okay? Uh, oh, I have a photo mark. So, but the first one, uh, the first video when I started like my um, active YouTubing, uh, like one month ago, or I don't know how many, um, I started with videos like Linux don't lag, okay? And uh, basically, what what is was going on there? So I was uh, launching some heavy websites. Uh, I mean, they're stupid, okay? Uh, and, but they made like whole Ubuntu freeze, okay? And I think it's like the problem not of Ubuntu but of all Linux. I don't know. I didn't check on others, but I think so. Yeah, and on Windows, the same website didn't crash my system, so. It was freezing, lagging, but overall system was working as 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 always. That is basically one reason. Зачем на американской аудитории переходить? На русском же намного больше людям интереснее и больше в целом. I don't agree. I mean, Russian Russians can also like Russian programmers or people. In general, I think everybody should understand English and learn it. It's not hard, guys. I mean, what is hard in English? I mean, first of all, maybe you should know like uh, some basic English, I don't know, uh, verbs, okay? I don't know, so here is like some basic uh, English verbs, okay? After that, you can read some, I don't know, English basic books, okay? Okay? Uh, I mean, not like, uh, but... Oh my. I mean, uh, fantasy or whatever genre you want, okay? But, of course, for, for children, okay? For children. Okay? So yeah, I don't know, Rapunzel, okay? Uh, maybe you should also learn uh, some grammar. English grammar. Uh, so yeah, you can just like learn something. But basically, uh, English, what you need is English pastime. 
past simple, right? English, I don't know. Future. Oh, and English present. And basically that's all. So after that you just, I don't know, read some books, I don't know. Um, learn new words by reading some, some something or I don't know. Even if you read like uh, computer stuff, you know, you'll just like use Google Translate or some more cooler things like terminal translators. Нет. Тоже была проблема с сохранением сессии удаленного терминала. Нужно было сохранить доступ к консоли сервера Minecraft. Долго искал и нашел только Tmax. Я Tmax. Okay, so let's continue. Uh... Okay, maybe we need to update like our Pac-Man list again. Okay, so let's try Startix. Uh, okay, uh, Startix. Xerx. X in it, okay. Yeah, I know it's like... Waiting for X server. Uh, TVM. Okay. okay. By the way, let's check that it doesn't have anything. Um, Arch Starlix. Xenit. Uh, yeah, Xenit or C. Okay. <coughs> Just copy paste it. So here I will, I don't know, start GVM, okay? I have it, right? GVM. I don't have GVM. It'll be funny if GVIM doesn't contain simple VIM. But yeah, of course, we will install not GVIM, we will Firefox mode. Okay, so we have GVIM, right? Yeah, we have GVM. So we did this. Uh, what else? Yeah, that's all. Startix. Uh, Zinc failed to load LibVulcan. Not this so. This is because I am on Windows. Maybe this is because I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe this is because we were telling box. Yeah, 
Might as well, let's check one sink, like resolve this one, right? Um, no, this is the same. Um, wait, what? <laughs> wow, it's actually round here. Yeah, it's actually round, right? Yeah, it's not accessible somewhere, but it's actually worked somehow. So it's actually starting running X server inside of virtual box. It's kind of fun, you know. It's really kind of fun. Okay, I don't know. I just remember one program called Remina. Remina. I don't know. Uh, remote desktop connection. Computer. Computer will be non specified. So user will be root connect connecting okay remote access Okay, first of all, let's do some settings. DC, SSH, SSH, D config. So, yeah, let's like do this stuff. And let's reboot. So, I will not have a display anymore. I will wait. No, I will not wait. You know. Okay, how did you set like run in <laughs> detachable server? I don't care, sorry. <laughs> Yeah, maybe you should just try it Ubuntu because maybe Arch is just not a very good option. I don't know. Okay, let's try. Oh my, I don't know. Maybe I should try Ubuntu. Oh my. No, wait, 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 wait. I wanted to start it with a breach mode. Started with a breach mode, so it will have some normal uh, SSH. I mean IP. Okay. And I'll quickly check. Um, to allow remote or RDP, right? Wait, what is this? 
Uh, what is this? Oh my God. No, I want to remove this. I want to reboot. Because I already installed it, by the way. Okay. Okay, so here we have some stuff. Okay. Name is this smooth I need. I don't know why I'm, do I'm doing it because in the end I will just use hosting that will provide everything. We are wasting a lot of time, guys. The time is money, you know. But everybody have its own decision-make system and usage of chance that he gets, you know? Why is it so long? Um, yeah, so every system has its rollbacks, you see, so Arch is it's blazingly fast, uh, Ubuntu is blazingly slow. My goodness. Oh, remote desktop protocol RDP. Wow, oh, it's over. Oh my god. Oh my god, well, I don't like how... Okay, let's go. So, first of all, it's very freezing. It's very, very freezing. IPA, so we have uh, this address ping 129.168.50.107. Okay, then we do copy this, have this all and paste this and all try. Of course, it will fail, right? Because why it should succeed? There's no reason. So, yeah, it failed, right? Yeah. So, some basic stuff. Okay, I will have to type myself so no. Update. Oh my god, it will take me ages. It will take me ages. Remind me later, please. <laughs> Is it colliding with this one? If yes, then oh my god. <laughs> Are you really Ubuntu? <laughs> Okay, I'll cancel and try again, maybe it will ask me again. Mm. Oh my god. <sighs> yeah, that's why I don't like you, Bunter, you know? Maybe you should just install it first, but it's like our package. And now we really need to compile, I guess. Yeah, I need to reboot it now. 
Mouse Washington. Yeah, but you know what? I thought like, um, why do I even need to like have like something remote and having display? Because I thought like Windows is actually saving your session, but actually it doesn't. Okay, it is not very reliable because today, for example, I turn up my PC and it didn't save anything. So. I don't know, I want to just try try this approach. Uh, what? So this here now. Yeah, I don't know what is going on here. Generate. Okay, we, it seems like we have like cool GUI function. Pretty cool. <coughs> Remote desktop. It is off. Okay, yeah. Uh, remote desktop. Yes. Okay, so. Legacy. Then. Remote control. Device name. Remote desktop address, uh, all I can password space. This is a soul. Okay. Wait, 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 I can do this. Yeah, that's all. Uh, okay, so I don't know, let's try again. It's kind of works, right? Yes. Okay. Um president don't yeah. Uh so yeah, it seems laggy, okay? But anyway, it seems like it's working, okay? 
Okay, I even control things, okay? It seems like I even control stuff. Uh, it seems like I control stuff. Why do I have full screen? Okay, now I have not a full screen, okay. <coughs> okay. So also you can see that so actual machine is actually like needs to be run and have a display something like that i think you know and that is kind of question like how people who have servers in their hosting stuff uh, will have like displays okay this is the question but yeah but general it is working so and by working is that i mean that okay now imagine like this is not on my computer, but, but on some hosting provider, and I just uh, turn off my PCs and I turn it back, and I go again to you know desktop connection. I press uh, the same stuff, okay? And yeah, so I'm back again. Uh, the place where I left, okay. Yeah, it's a little bit laggy, okay, but maybe this is like because of my virtual machine is very uh, bad quality, I mean, very bad in resources. And just let's check the browsing experience, and I think that's all. Yeah, and of course, uh, from here I will I will be able to use VPN, create a VPN, I think, without any problem, you know. Okay, I don't like it. Why? Why it doesn't give me Git? Okay, guys, uh, Microsoft Ed Edge is better. Because what is this? No, this this should be on the first place, you know. Yeah, it's kind of laggy, you know. It's kind of laggy. But I think, uh, anyway, we will have to try it on the real hosting stuff, so yeah, without it, it will be hard. Um, yeah, that's all. Um, so now let's just a little search. For a hosting, hosting, and a pin. Mm, yeah, I don't know who to trust, okay. Okay, hyperhost. Maybe I should trust this one. Okay, they have a telephone number. Okay, video start. It have a RDP, it have two cores, which is quite of K. 15 gigs and 4 gigs. Uh, yeah, I think we should try this one. Background we are simply select okay it's Windows I don't like it but even if I don't like it is it actual problem for me I think no yeah it's not actual problem because 
because I don't care. I don't care. Disappear. I don't see RDP here. I don't think RDP. <coughs> Okay, so probably I just could just try this one. Order server. Uh, you choose the desired tariff and number of simultaneous users. Hyperhost. Okay, I want to try this website. Okay, it seems nice. Uh, it seems nice, not like uh, some jokers. Okay. Yeah, but I like it. Mm. Monthly price if you pay by only. Oh, okay, it's 21 actually. It's actually 21. I don't know what this is by annually, but this looks like it's actually $21. On version of Visual. Okay, it seems cool. Licenses, do I need licenses or I can customer reviews, trust. Okay. Okay, it's always subtime, okay. Why do you say KVM? It's like for Linux, I thought. Mm. Yeah, I don't want to call them actually because, I mean, of course, they will manipulate me very high and say, well, we are the best, everything is secure, blah, blah, blah. But I want to actually have something like Hyper cost, uh, hyper cost. How to say it? Um, bad words. Hmm. Just trust pilot. <coughs> Hypercost is kind of excellent, right? Where is this command was? Okay, it's pretty. But what is trust pilot? <laughs> yeah, I want to check Google. <laughs> <laughs> oh my <laughs> Yeah, it's it's definitely a good <laughs> website. <laughs> oh my. Okay, what what if I do what if you say on this? Hmm. Only 4.2 out of 5. Oh my. Once upon a time, once upon a time, we'll <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, the problem is, I don't know, like, is it actually like, I don't know. Okay, 
because I don't know, maybe that bot like this, like only 73, like they could bot it, right? Okay, but let's read like bad, okay? Very poor services and very poor services, they were very good, but in the last they become very bad. Every day of couple we must see, we're seeing the sites can load well or down and the tech support check, fix it. And every time they back to us with a different reason, promising to fix it, but nothing happened and we see the errors. In the end, they did. <sighs> yeah, this was what what I was so what I was searching for. As the company has, as they blocked my account and closed all my servers, and they have stolen my account, guys. Oh yeah, so I think this is this one is the bullet point why why we cannot do this stuff, okay? Because if you really want, uh, if you really care about your security, uh, your personal stuff and and your work stuff, okay. You cannot really like um, use something external from somebody else, okay? Yeah. I mean, this is bad, but this is how life is. So. Unfortunate. So it looks like for graphic stuff, like reading manuals and other stuff, I will keep using my. <clears throat> local PC. Another option maybe uh, will be to set up some computer on my uh, in my office and to connect to it to it with RDP. RDP. Um, but I think it will be not very good because. I will need to ask for a PC for that. I don't have any other PC, so yeah, it's kind of. Maybe I could use my uh, Mac, MacBook Air, but it's old. Yeah, actually, let's try it. You know what? Yeah. Yeah, actually, let's try it. Okay. Yeah, I will have to make to have. I will, I will try to have a time and to check my MacBook Air for a virtualization stuff. And if it will succeed, then in theory I can go to my office, place it there. Like of course power supplied. Uh, luckily we don't have uh, electricity issues right now, uh, so I. I will power supply it and connect it to the network and after that I will just connect to it to, uh, with um, RDP and of course on my PC I will just use VPN and RDP into it after that. Yeah, I think this is a nice idea. Um, yeah, <laughs> my coworkers in theory could <laughs> just go through and <laughs> watch what I'm doing. <laughs> That's how life is. Okay, guys, um, subscribe to my channel, uh, leave a like, leave a comment, share this video to your grandfather. Okay, trust me, he needs it.